Athletes all over the country are impacted by COVID-19 for the last eight months, especially those in local sports organizations. But as KSBY's Rob Schiff tells us, one organization is doing everything it can to make sure the athletes can still have fun. The Special Olympics Santa Maria is home to about 300 athletes. And since March, things might have changed a bit, but it hasn't stopped the athletes from staying active, staying positive, and living in the moment, but still being excited about what lies ahead. We like doing stuff together and it felt pretty sad when they said sports would be closed. For Andrea and other athletes at Special Olympics Santa Maria, it's been a while since this field looked a little bit more like this one. We've had to kind of pivot and change directions and move to virtual programming. So that's really been our ultimate goal right now, you know, since COVID hit is to, you know, keep them active, engaged and fit while they're at home. We've been doing fitness challenging together, like a lot of stretches. And those virtual workouts being led by a variety of people from athletes themselves, volunteers from all over California, even NFL football players. And for the athletes here in Santa Maria, this is phase zero, meaning everything is virtual right now. And it'll stay that way until at least the spring. Phase one is where we will kind of do groups of no more than 10. That won't start until April. But despite virtual engagement being the new normal for now, Andrea says it's still a lot of fun and she's excited to be a part of it. Even though we lose contact, contact with, the, with our friends, we still have that socialization going on. We can't play sports, but we understand that, but we still want to be part of a team. In Santa Maria, Rob Schiff, KSBY News. And if you'd like to volunteer for the Healthy Lifestyle Challenge, you can find those details on our website, ksby.com.